With their bowl hopes on the line, the Cougars welcomed Oregon State to town for a must-win game on the Palouse today. Also the final home game for the Cougars. Honoring the seniors beforehand, one of those, Alex Brink. Well, it wasn't a good day full of good memories for any of those seniors. Evanson Bernard high steps his way into the end zone. Oregon State up 14-0 early. Brink under pressure all night long. Scrambling throws back over the middle into the hands of Joey LaRock. One of seven interceptions by the Cougars, six of which came from Brink. Well, the Cougar defense, not much better, allowing six rushing touchdowns. This one to James Rogers. Beavers up by as much as 28 points. Cougars did find the end zone twice, both Kevin McCall touchdowns, but it was already over. Beavers hand the Cougs a 35-point loss and in all hopes of going to a bowl game. Rick Lukens has more from Pullman. That one hurt. That hurt a lot. I, I, uh, I would have never guessed that in a million years. I thought it would be a, a real close ball game. One of the things the Cougars didn't expect is that quarterback Alex Brink in his final home game would toss five interceptions in the first half. They got a lot of pressure on us. I mean, they were able to, you know, send four guys and get pressure with their ends and you know, I was, um, their pressure was definitely got to us. With this loss, the Cougars cannot get six wins, so cannot play in a bowl game. But even worse than that for the Cougars seniors, they walk out of this stadium for the last time with a very bad taste in their mouths. I wouldn't imagine my last game in Martin Stadium, even with the whole atmosphere with 20 people in the stands and raining and, you know, and just the way we lost. But, you know, that's part of the game. That's life. You know, everything's not going to happen the way you want it to, and you learn from it. So it's one more game to go, but it's a big one. The Apple Cup next week in Seattle. It'll be a lot warmer this winter, you know, with a, with a win against the Huskies. From Pullman, Rick Lukens, KXLY 4 News.